Hey there, so today I'm going to share with you a nail design. I'm going to use it as my um, French tips. Um, so what you're going to need are two colors, any colors you want, but preferably these type of bottles, the one with, that you use for like art designs or whatnot with a thin um, brush. Um, you're also going to need a sharp little object. I'm using a sewing needle and that's pretty much it. So what you're going to do is take your first color and of course make sure your nails are clean and everything. So I'm going to do that on my um, pointy finger. See if I could zoom that in. Um, first thing I'm going to do is take my first color and try to get a generous amount on the brush um, like a thick amount like I don't know if you can see that but yeah just a thick amount and you're going to make diagonal lines going this way from long just different sizes and then you want to go over it again like that and then you want to make sure both bottles are open and ready for you because you have to do it fast otherwise you know before the um, second color dries up and you want to eyeball it first to make sure and see what length of um, design oops sorry hold on I forgot one more okay so now what I'm going to do is take the sharp object and just drag the color diagonal just lightly so you get that cool effect like that I don't know if you can see that yeah so I'm going to do it on the second nail take a generous amount again And just make diagonal lines. And it doesn't matter, I mean, if it's long, short, or whatnot. But start off long and then, you know, make them shorter. And then take the second color. And just fill in the other ones, the other lines in between. just like that and then you're just gonna sorry there's a good gap right there you're going to take the sharp object and just drag so the reason why you want to um, apply a generous amount onto the um, nail is just so that the nail polish gets to move smoothly so looks like that so I'm just gonna do it on those two fingers um, and then I'm going to show you um, how to clean up the bottom to make a perfect line underneath. So I'm going to do it on, hold on, okay, I'm going to do it on this finger right here, my pointy finger. I'm, I took some acetone, put it in a little, you know, the little cap. And I'm using an extra concealer brush. This one's actually a pointier tip. So what I'm going to do is just dip it into the little cap. And then, sorry, I'm just going to clean up underneath. To just shape it underneath. To give it more of a rounder shape and an even shape on the bottom because you know it looks neater and this really this technique really works so if you just have like a um extra like concealer brush lying around use it because it really really works as you can see here so it really cleans up the edges and gives you that um, round, clean effect underneath your nails. So I'm just trying to even it out. So there you go. So you get that rounded part underneath and it's very clean compared to that. So that's it. That's um, a fun design to do.
And then you could, um, as a base coat, I'm probably going to use this right here. This is from Sally's. It's a French, um, French natural. You could see that. And then just use that as um, the base coat right here. I'm just going to fill in it, fill in with that color. And then after that, apply a top coat as well. And I think I have. I don't know. You can use whatever top coat you use. So that's it. That's my little technique. Hopefully you guys have fun with this and try it out. Thanks for watching. Bye.